Hey folks, this is Noble Rambler, and welcome to another episode of Let's Play RimWorld. We're in Alpha 13, in our town of Cougar's Hope. And before I get started, we've got a few things to talk about, because I don't know what they're going to do when I release them. We've got two terrible moods to deal with, first of all, but actually I think they're going to be okay. We have Ronnie and Klaus, and they're both sick with that, uh, all that disease, fibrous mechanitis. So that's causing a lot of pain, a lot of uh, negatives. So, feeling terrible. Um, Ronnie especially, she's one who is actually below the the, uh, the lower break point, but is resting right now. It's going to take a huge bonus, so that's going to get her up of uh, both lines. And then uh, we're just going to have to gonna have to baby here for a while. Klaus is in a little better shape. He's between hard break and soft break, and he's getting a little more rest, which is going to help get him... Well, I guess he's pretty much where he's going to go now. So really, it's a matter of getting him into, uh, probably into a fine meal. Kind of help him out. Very hot is still an issue. We're still in a heat wave. Uh, Nettie is the other one with the disease, and she's doing pretty good. She's the only one with low expectations still. I don't know why that is. Um, <clears throat> I went through after our, uh, our bug problem last time, and thought about the rest of the construction out here. What I'm going to do is I'm going to go ahead and put in two more bedrooms and they're going to be in bug zone here just like these are. This one I don't think is a problem. You can see the original walls here that uh, um, designate where there used to be mountain that we've tunneled into. So something like this and around and you can see the dirt here so it, it went something like this and over like that and then off into this area so all the different places we tunneled in so I'm going to leave these rooms that have the potential bug problems as double walled granite I think that's what I'm going to do it's an odd size here I had to lengthen them to get the same number of, of uh, blocks inside you know, the square footage and yet not cut into our storage area here so these are 7 by 4s, which is 28 squares. These are 25 squares, so they should be similar. I would like to make these even bigger. The only way I can really do it is to push into this area because we're cutting... Well, I've got a double wide hallway coming through here. We could come even further down if we were to add even more walls over here. That's a possibility. Then we can bring this further down. Huh. Let's do that. We'll do that after we turn it on, though. What else is going on that I've changed before we get going? I'm going to pretty this area up a little bit, make it more of the dining social room, put a pool table in here and kind of clean this up. This guy, wood crafter's table, we could get outside, though it's be kind of nice to have it in a warm place. Where are we now? Spring, so... Hmm, in a cool place. <laughs> for the summer. Um, I'm going to build the prison down here. I was thinking about up in here. I think it would be better to move all of this down below and then rip all this out and rethink what it's going to actually be. So we'll kind of get our, our options opened again. We need a hospital. And we could do something different. Well, from this whole this whole section right here, including this, could all be something different. Now, one concern I had last time, as I ended last episode, <clears throat> bugs appeared in here and we burned everything out of here. What if bugs appeared in here? We could burn everything out of here. We'd lose everything in here. That would hurt. Same thing here. Pretty much the entire kitchen refrigerator is enclosed and buggable. So, what if we lose all of our food in one one wallop? Not real sure what to do about that, other than moving everything out into like this area. Hate to go to all that trouble. We we could create a brand new kitchen and storage out here, and do something else with these spaces. Something that if we lose it, we don't really lose anything. So there's that to kick around. Not something I'm going to be able to do this time. I'm hoping this episode is kind of a maintenance episode to catch up on things and clean up and what have you. I went through and redid the work 
uh, ones to designate that that's a temporary job. Need to turn that back off later. Otherwise, got everyone set up to do what their passion is, what they enjoy doing, as much as I can. Uh, Dwayne, actually Dwayne is set for crafting, which is going to be stone blocks, which I'm switching over to granite blocks. We do all this in granite instead. Granite will is stronger than uh, than marble. Marble was convenient, but now there's lots of granite left, so we'll, we'll switch over to that. Um, Vapa's primary right now is going to be growing, and then when that's not happening, it will be cleaning. And eventually, we'll switch him back to probably something like art. Well, we have art. We have hunting. Remind me, Vapa, you've got a rifle. That's a possibility. And then we've got Ronnie, who enjoys hunting. Passion, in fact, double passion for for hunting. Does it say right there? Uh, average doesn't say passion in the description. But in that, I did queue up a whole bunch of these wild boars to get her outside. Though first thing she needs to do is is get a meal or actually get some sleep. So we'll leave her alone. But when she's not hunting, she will drop into hauling. Now hauling, I got to thinking about all of our three infected colonists have a very fast walk speed. So it would be a good idea to get them doing things that require speed, like hauling. Really quickly go out and get that stuff and bring it in at double speed. So we're going to make use of that for whatever time is left in this uh, uh, before they're, they're healed of it. Eric is our researcher and he's darn good at it. 16 out of 20, but he's also really good at construction. So let's get some of this built, then we'll switch him out of that green one there back to, you know, switch that back to a two and or a three, actually. So he'll his first two will be over here at research. I try to use as few ones as possible out here, so that basically two is the new one, so that it's easy in an emergency to quickly turn everybody onto one in one section, and there's no other ones to compete with other than these guys, which are highest priority at all times. So it's make your two your one. And then your three, your fallback, and four just means they're capable of it. They'll probably never get to it. All of these mining, I want everyone capable of mining. If I just say, hey you, go ahead and take that out for me, thank you. And they'll just go and do it because it's turned on. They're no good at it, it's gonna take them forever, but it's, it's possible. So mining, plant cutting, hauling, cleaning, all those menial tasks, even construction. Get someone just to go over and build that one wall space or just to repair that one section of wall as you're walking by. It's important. So there's the layout right now. We've basically got Nettie set to grow and then tailor. We've got Rabbit set to cook and then grow. And his fall back then is his first three, so handle. Michael, I've got to mine. And then art, which he really enjoys doing. He's good at it, too. And then brand, set to warden. And then smith. Dwayne is going to craft. So there's the three crafters. Crafting, tailoring, and smithing. And then Rokes is my primary builder. He's 20 out of 20 now. But the thing that never gets done is repair. Now, something to kick around with your own games. Repair always has to wait until construction is done, and there's always construction to do on a game. So if you set your repair up one notch more, then at least get to the repairing part first, which generally is only a piece or two here and there. So it's important to give that a higher priority. It's rarely going to come up anyway. A bunch of repairs after a battle, you know, the wall got shot up, or a turret got damaged. You want to get those back up and running again, then go to your construction. Then he'll mine. He's good at that one as his backup. Uh, and then Klaus is really good at at mining, but he's having a problem with being in tight spaces right now. So I've got him with his disease. He's got a lot of uh, speed in his walk. So I've got him set to haul first, row next, and then plant cut. I queued up a whole bunch of trees to be cut out. So that will get him outside and in open spaces, which will help boost his... Uh, his needs there so let this thing run and let's just see what happens so while we're going we'll just watch these guys for a moment make sure everything is going okay 
I don't see any red flags right now. I turned this guy off. I think we're fine. In fact, let's... What do we have? This has never been built. Okay. Um, someone was trying to load this up with wood, and we have so little wood that I just got to thinking, we're making all that we need out of this guy, right? Now oh, we're going into nighttime. So we've got a negative power load right now because the, uh, fo the solar panels are no longer bringing in their share. So we don't have enough to maintain. But we're doing a... F well, we'll see what this happens, what this does. This guy gives what? It's not going to tell me in the description here. Will it tell me here? Power right there. Does not say what it's capable of making. Well, that's frustrating. Uh, information? Let's try this way. Will not say what it's capable of. It makes power. Come on, I want to know if it makes a thousand watts or what it makes. Anyway, so I turn him off. I'm hoping that this guy can maintain through the night and we don't have to keep feeding that wood for a while. That's more of a backup. Uh, solar Eclipse. This would be really handy to have as well as this one. So, I'm not getting the sense of any red flags. Ronnie, you are aware right now. You're back in positive territory. No, you're not. You're still sitting over here. Your, your, your aim is right there. That's where you're going to be headed to. Probably once the rest is done, it'll reset. So, you'll be fine. Um, plenty of good meals. Rabbit is sleeping. Okay. So, let's extend these down one block. I think so. Need to get this built before we can do it, though. So we get that built, and we'll put another row in front of it, maybe one more. Tear these out. The, the hallway will be down a little bit further. But if we take this out, Klaus's room is available. So we could start taking that one out soon without waking him up. I don't want to disturb his sleep. Uh, mental state days. Klaus. Okay. Where are you? You're right here. You're dazed. Uh, needs... You did drop, but you were headed for here. You were so close. All right, well, we'll see what Klaus does in his days. He'll probably strip off all of his clothes and start singing to butterflies, but, but we'll see. Um, back on. So I want to extend these down one space, make these all five spaces bigger to get 30, uh, 30 squares out of here, 30 square feet, 30 square meters probably. I don't know. Twin bed is three feet wide. That's probably a meter. Yeah, so we'll say that's six meters, or five meters right there. That's probably a, uh, a correct assumption. So, extend these all down by one. Which means one, two, three... Hey, that worked. I accidentally left three spaces instead of two. Oh, good. Okay. So, I want structure granite wall there, there that. I want a let's see. I want a wood door on the outside which is the door they're actually going to use. I want a granite door or marble. Okay, that's probably the original right there. Let's delete those that All right, so wood door on the outside. I'm going to put a granite door on the inside. That's the bug door. And we're not going to actually use it. What do I have here? Ah, I'm jumping spaces there. Cancel you, cancel you. All right. Granite door there. Wood door there. We'll lock these guys open and just use the wood door for the bedroom. If there's a problem, we will unlock the uh, the granite door. That'll be our first barrier, first line of defense against the bugs. That's the plan. I want them to get this one done so I can get this hallway available. Then I can punch through here and get into here easier. In fact, let's pause. Where is Rokes? Is he sleeping? Yeah. Who can build? Dwayne can build, but he is busy making granite, and I need all the granite I can get. Ronnie's doing some joy, and I'm not going to disturb that at all. In fact, that's... A Something else I forgot to do. Restrict? Yeah. Let's joy out. Ronnie, where are you? There you are. As well. And Nettie, half as much, since she's not close to a break. You're up here. But you do still have the issues. OK, 
Okay, we'll do that. Um, so I need someone to build that door, which is lacking 25 marble blocks, which we have 550. Who's up? Nettie's up. Great. You're playing horseshoes. Ugh. I think I better let you. See, do I have any other choices? I just have Dwayne. Okay. Uh, but Nettie's the builder. She's got the skill to do it. All right, we'll just give her a little bit of time before we go back to this. Because I'll forget. How you doing for your joy? Needs. You're about halfway there. Okay, well, we'll do our best to not forget. Granite wall is going to go there, there, and actually there. And then we're going to mine out that, that. And we're going to cancel that. All right. Ronnie is now playing horseshoes as well. Nettie needs... You're basically there. There we go. Please do that one. Get that one built so we can get this in. Then we can bust through all of this and get into here and get access to everything. Because this is going to get filled in faster than, than we think. And we're not going to have access to it again. You need to be deconstructed. Okay. So Ronnie is out hunting, which she will... Mood is there. Food. Actually, before you do that, well, I'll tell you what. You're fine. You'll hunt. You will bring back your first animal, and you will then get a, a good meal. Now, I haven't done a predator to check. How are we doing out here? Bear. Grizzly. Female. 12 years old. <clears throat> not going to eat for a while. And just has an old scar. Last I remembered, cougar was over here. Male. 8 years old. Ready to eat soon. Ronnie is... Charge rifle. Yeah. Alright, that's done. What are you? Turtle. Why is there a symbol right there? Is, oh, that's a head. I've never looked that close. There's two eyes, a nose, and a mouth. Huh. Okay. <laughs> I've only just noticed this shell before. How's our defenses? Still have some traps to build because we still need lots and lots of... I need to get it picked up. Need, we need lots of steel. Personal shield is pretty much shot. Klaus is still wandering. Mental state, dazed and wandering. Still has all of his gear though. Okay. I'm impressed. Uh, needs decent. Need some rest soon. Beauty not good. Oh, I didn't stop Ronnie in time. And you're done. Okay. No longer dazed. Klaus is going to rest. Yeah, good. Now, Ronnie, I want you to get a good meal because I want to assign you to do something. So drop that off. Are you going to do this on your own? Nope. Then how about you consume a good meal? Now, where are we here? Good. Michael is disturbing Klaus, of course. <laughs> Disturb sleep. I guess this all counts as one. Okay, I'll work with that. All right, that's good. And I will not mark that one to haul just yet. Uh, Michael, you are mining. How about mining this one out so we can get that done before Ronnie goes to uh, back to bed. Where did Ronnie sneak off to now? She's over there. Before you do that, this bear has gotten quite close. I think it's time to do something with him. And Ronnie can run twice as fast. That's one thing I'm thinking about. We might be able to... Uh, take the bear out just by standing right here. We'll see. Ronnie, run speed. Five. Not as fast as uh, uh, Klaus, I believe. Right? Klaus was a six. 6.2 with that disease. Now, Ronnie, you are right there. 
So I'm thinking you can pop the bear and run out ahead and stay ahead of him far enough. Actually, right here. Out of range. There. Fire Grizzly. Okay. Run over here. Fire at Grizzly. Okay. Run over here. Grizzly, don't go after Nettie. Gotcha. Okay. All Grizzly. All right, go back to your hunting. She's getting good at shooting, that's for sure. What is her skill now? Shooting 13. Great. All right, they're starting to build. I gotta make sure that they're not gonna get ahead of me now. Dwayne is stone cutting. Oh, he's grabbing some, some granite, good. All right, so the back of the room's gonna be here now. So we need to granite wall this strip. And it'll be two walls wide, two walls wide. This really could use two walls wide as well. So what I'm going to do is as soon as these are built probably abandon these rooms build a second wall right right here take this one out but two walls there take these out and put two walls over here so we'll shift them all down a little bit this one i'm not going to worry about double walling i don't think bugs would ever infest this one okay so construction wise one two three four that's in the right place these are in the right place. I left that open. I should probably... We still don't have this one built. Okay, Rokes. Let's start here. Get that one done so we can use that. Otherwise, I need to leave this open so that they can walk through this because I can't bust into this yet. So if we can get that one going, then I can do that. Uh, Grizzly's in there. Ronnie's on her way back out again. Good. And so the other two predators were not something to worry about yet. The bear, actually cougar, was just eight. Okay. Grizzly, you're going to be before the episode ends. Nobody else has wandered out here. I thought about taking these wild boar out, but there are too many other boom booms in the area. So all of a sudden, what you can see we've lost all of our trees in here due to fires. I don't want to do it again and wipe all this area out too. They take a long time to regrow. We planted these not long after we got here. And we're only 58% grown after all this time. So it takes a long time to get trees going. I did queue up a lot of them in here. You can kind of see them. Right in there. That one. A lot of these. A lot of these in here. I went through basically there, there down this side over here, and strays all through here. So this should, I would think Klaus, who was sleeping and still is, okay. He's actually heading into good territory here. Once he gets a good meal in him, he should be fine for a while. Uh, health, mild pain, Ronnie, mild pain. So next treatment is when? 21 hours, okay. And she's doing what? She's tanking again, why? Her joy is, is pretty well maxed out. She could use some rest soon. Now, are we done disturbing her room? Kind of. Who could haul real quick? Let's get this stuff out of her room before someone else decides to haul. Bran, you can go right back to that when you're done, but let's get these guys hauled out. Because she's going to need to sleep, and she's going to need to be undisturbed. She seems to be the most volatile at the moment. So, is this considered not sealed I wonder tell you what leave that right there and can you build Rand can you build that space there's no granite in the area darn okay and then I need to do one more thing we're taking out a lot of stuff here and I've got to make sure we don't have a cave in I don't know what the distances are through this run right here so, someone like Michael, can you build me that wall space? We can just fill that in. Put 
the one I wanted you to do. Can you just do the one I wanted you to do? Brand. No! Okay. Cancel. You, you can't? Why can't you walk right there? Try that again. Do this one. There we go. Now, can you just build it? Do you have any disturbed sleeps in you right now? Do not. So that diagonal space right there didn't count. Okay. You're marble, so Dwayne is not going to come steal that one. Like he's off to steal this one. He's doing this really quick. Uh, Dwayne character crafting seven. Hmm. The rate I keep seeing him pop into here, I would have thought that was like a 10 or 12. Well, doing a good job there. You're marble. And you're not. Oh well. Now, is there anything here that they cannot reach? That can be reached from there. That can be reached from there. Let's put this wall piece back in. Granite right there. Alright, we're good now. We've got to clean this up later. Okay, meals. We're getting low. Why is that? Rabbit, I just saw walking this way. Because we don't have... What are you? Rotting potatoes? Is that what's going on? Temperature in here is 48 degrees. Set for 30. Oh, heat wave is still going on. Okay. We're rotting. So he's going to get good potatoes out here. And these are rotting, I'm sure. Suppose in a season, though. Twenty-two out of one hundred. And he's skipping these to use these. Very interesting. Huh. Okay, I'm going to do this. Rabbit, first of all, you're going to haul all of these. And who's available to experiment with something? If I want... Boy, I need someone who can haul. Dwayne, you're resting. Before you do, what happens if I ask you to haul? Well, they're considered to be in the right place. Huh. Well, haul these. Actually, haul these. Dwayne. Haul these. Klaus, you are meditating. How's your joy? I'll leave you alone. Okay, I need to get these guys indoors. This heat wave is probably not going to last much longer, so I'm not going to bust through and build another cooler at this point. It's temporary and it's going to go away. Alright, we have that pathway there and that pathway there. This got done. Oh, good. Let's hear this one out. That goes away. This is the new jail. Uh, these can go away. We'll put another stone or a stone wall in there with that noise was Bran failed to recruit Pukram again. Pukram has been really stubborn. I mean 88% chance by our standards that's really good. I mean we've been doing 94% or so. Alright that's all torn apart. Let's get a granite wall in there. And Rokes work on Rokes. That one. And Eric, can you haul these out? And Rokes, work on this one. Let's get this jail done. I don't need a double wall on the inside. I'm doubled on the outside, though. There's Flash uh, for invasion. But... I'm guessing they're going to bust through a door before they're going to bust through a wall. So I don't think I need to worry about that. And I'm also, one of the, the other goals is to you know, taking all these walls down and rebuilding them is that I'll be able to run power conduit inside of them. Get the uh, power. What's that? 
group of travelers passing by. Get the uglies out of the rooms. That's kind of what I'm what I'm trying to do. I've had to to run through rooms because there's just no wall to travel through. And also, I guess I can let that run. Um, walls have no beauty value. They're they're neutral, even the the nicer stone ones. But the old uh, the stone walls, the uh, the original mountain has a negative one. So we want to get rid of that. Ronnie sleeping in here is probably not a great thing. What if there is a vapors in there? Hmm. Because Ronnie is actually taking a negative the whole time she's sleeping. Beauty is heading down instead of heading up. She's almost there anyway. Okay, never mind. Let her finish. Damage is done. We'll clean this one up this uh, this time. Okay. So visitors coming by. And already lost the message. Here they are. We don't have any traders there, so there's no point in chasing them down. So, looking things over. Food is getting hauled and replanted. This is rice, right? Rice, yep. Yeah. Ronnie's up. Let's set. Actually, let's mine this out. Uh, architect orders, mine. Well, let me think about that. No, not going to happen. We got to take out. We got to add another wall here. There's there's too much to do. I had one there. This wall is actually not going to exist afterward. Well, I guess there's no reason why I can't. Severe illness. Let's tell you what. Cancel that. But we could build the next wall right here. That one's going to come out. That gets a, f a wall added there. This one comes out. And there's two walls here. We could get that one built. Right there. We can get to this one from here. We can get to that one from there. And then this will continue down later, I believe. Let me check that. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. That's the room. And then two walls. Okay, that's all correct. Yep. Now who's Pukram? Pukram? What you got? Uh, health? Heat stroke. Extreme. Ah. I can't move Pukram into the refrigerator to cool her down. Interesting situation there. So Tribu's Tribo is probably just minor. So we are 103 in here and 103 in there. Outside we are 127. Wow, this is not going away. And I can't just pop this. We'll no longer have a prison. Ha! Ah, which reminds me, I need to get air into here. That is a door. This needs to instead be a vent. So, right there. Okay, so that's a vent. Um, what do we do here? What are you wearing? Shirt pants, toque. So let's strip and take the uh, take the the toque away. The toque information is adding. Let's see if we have a temperature. Uh, well, I can't say it's it's adding so many degrees, but yeah, the toque is warming her up. That's probably going to help. So brand strip. Unfortunately, I can't make her just take off one thing. And then, haul. When Pukram gets up, if Pukram can get up, 
she will put her stuff back on. Oh, actually, you know, Rokes, can you, like, grab the, uh, the personal shield there? Thank you. <laughs> that could be a little important. Make sure she's not wearing that. Trebo, what are you wearing? You're, you've got a parka. Okay, we need to do the same thing. Huh. But she's not going to put her other back on, but she's in bed forever anyway. Okay, so we'll do the same thing. Though not Rokes. Um, Nettie, you are building Brand. Michael. Now I guess Rokes. Just drop that there and do that as well. Cargo pods in a moment. And haul that one. Okay. For that matter, haul this one too. Okay. So, cargo pods. Jump to location. Corn. Yeah. But we're going to have to specifically go and get that, right? When are you going to spoil? Three seasons. So it's not going to spoil, but these bunnies are definitely going to eat it. So, all right, how you doing, Grizzly? You're going to eat soon. There's lots of boom rats and cougars, boomalopes. Should be no problem. Um, who has got a good running speed that can go do that? Klaus, how you doing? You are hauling. Your needs are fine. Why don't you come down here and grab as many of these as you can. Wow, there's a lot of them there. It's almost one whole trip just in that one bundle. So Ronnie is the next one, and then Nettie was down here. Has snuck away. There you are. You are hauling wood to door blueprint. But before you do that, come and grab all of these. And we'll let Ronnie make it back to the freezer. Needs, you're good for a while. So at that point, you can wear a steel helmet. Sure. Ah, so... Someone. Brand? Brand just made a new uh, steel helmet. Okay. So she's trading hers in. Her normal 50% one in for a poor 100% one. Okay, and you are hunting after you pick up the rest of this corn. Right there. Alright, let's see how well we do this. How much is left over? Otherwise... All these guys are set to tame. Rabbit has got a lot of our... That's right, so we've still got to get more food. Well, the corn will help. Rabbit's spending a lot of time walking outdoors to get food, so we're not getting the full advantage of... Looks like that might pick up fine. What's left down here? Three corn. That doesn't help. 33, 16, 26. Yeah, so uh, Ronnie would get the rest. But by having to walk out here to get... The vegetables because he's not willing to use these is it this color because it's dark no that's dark they still look it still looks browner to me than this one brand is resting so he's not willing to use these hmm grab it sleeping anyway I'll have to watch him when he wakes up tomorrow. See how uh, how he reacts to that. Otherwise, we need to get all this stuff hauled in. We need to get this stuff hauled out. It's not officially rotten. It's just getting there. So is everything degraded? The meat has not. So was all the stuff sitting outside, and that's why it's in that condition? Could well be. It all sat outside for too long. I would think they'd still use it. But, not sure.
Okay, while they're sleeping, let's do another predator check. Has anything new moved into the map? Looking pretty clear. Just these guys. Okay. <sighs> so is there anything more to be doing or should I just speed this up? Dwayne doesn't have a bed. I normally don't speed it up because I find all the things that unknown. Interesting. They used to be Eric's. Right? Eric's down here now with Dwayne. Because this was a hospital bed. Alright, that's why. So Eric assigned there. That's now an unowned. So Dwayne has got this one. And he just... He's stargazing. He's a night owl. Okay. Hmm. And now he's stone cutting. Okay. Uh, corn all got in? Yes. Pukram is no longer capable of walking. Alright, so Pukram... Oh my! Put those clothes back on. Is going to get dressed and not get overheated this time. So how you doing now? Needs lots of negatives, but still in a good mood. Need to be fed. Dwayne, I don't believe, has the ability to do that. So we're waiting for... That would be Brand. He's actually doing okay. I think it's time to get him up. Let's feed Pukram. Then you can get yourself a meal. Rabbit is going back to work. Tending to Nettie. All right, so medicine time for the for the three sickos, and hopefully if we're getting close to done on that. I don't know how many days it's been. I'm told it's a 20-day disease. I doubt it's been that many. We spent uh, most of last time paused, focusing on that space right there. I don't think there's much more to do. Let's go ahead and kick the speed up for a little while. Eating. Be glad when they get this floor in here just so that we don't see all those squares anymore. You know, this is built. I think about that. Did that continue to get... It did. Okay. Um, there's something to, to deal with. Michael is where right now? Slow this back down again. Michael's over here. Is there a chance I can convince you to mine steel? Forgot to check. Needs, you're doing fine. Except for joy. But you'll get joy in your work. Now, what I learned last time, we've got to watch him. Apparently, they go a certain distance and they recalculate. Where's the nearest mining job? Oh, it's back over here again. So let's keep an eye on, on this pathway here. See how far he goes. He was here. Let's see how far he gets before he recalculates his, uh, his job. So far, so good. Nope, there it is. Triggered to that point. I wonder if a doorway triggers it. Don't know. Let's come and take care of this one. That's corn. 22. Okay. So, Nettie, you've got a good walk speed. Can you haul these guys in? Vapa, while you're on your way in, please bring these. Michael did continue. Though he changed his mind. And he's mining that one. All right, one more time. I want to do this one. We need steel, and we need it bad. 
Actually, this one. That gives you a way out that doesn't have these blocks in the way. Failed to recruit again. Before long, we may have to say goodbye to Pukram. Well, I really want her, though. Are right, you going to... You gonna hang here? Okay. And since his since these are good, that's on its way up. I have a feeling he'll stay the uh, the whole thing, you know, the whole uh, job. Hookrum. Convinced by Warden 42. 88% chance. Actually, not the greatest at a lot of things. But I need some more female characters. Now, Pukram is a nudist. Would she be happier? I know she would be happier. But it's going to be awfully distracting for Bran to come in and talk to her. <laughs> oh, let's see. Nettie, I know you love doing that. But you've got a good running speed, and I need as many of these indoors as possible. That's right, Rabbit. I want to take an... I want to watch this. You are... Missing. Where's Rabbit? You were doctoring. Okay. Now you are cooking a fine meal. Let's see how it is you do that. You've got 75 bad potatoes and... 15 boom of meat. And you're not willing to use these potatoes. You want these potatoes. Which are just as bad. What am I not getting here? Alright, let's do something. Um, haul these meals in. So we don't have any issues there. And let's set these guys... This guy for... Low. Drop that off. Let's haul these guys out of here. Let's haul these guys out of here. And let's haul the mules out of here. Alright. Then we're going to... Klaus, you are... Okay. We're going to set this one back to critical. Klaus, let's have you haul a brand new batch in. Are you clear? Yeah, okay. Uh, Alright, you picked it up again and you're hauling that stack of potatoes from the outside to that space. Alright. So Rabbit is now going to try cooking. I didn't see what he's bringing. Darn. Let's not. Let's leave that there. Let's haul all of these in. Okay. This space is not fully refrigerated, but 51. We're 30 degrees in here again. Oh, I didn't notice it. Our heat wave's gone. Oh, good. Now you're back to working again. Alright, so we're almost there. So, tell you what, get this one done. Klaus, tell me you can do it, Klaus. You stop there. Let's haul these away. Klaus, there we go. Haul those away. Now, where did those strawberries go? Should be 75 fresh strawberries. 93. 93, that's as good as we're going to get. Alright, one more time. I want you to bring this group to there. All right. And then, tell you what, grab this as well. Grizzly bear meat. Haul. Now Rabbit is set. And Rabbit is probably doing more doctoring. Right there. He needed a break. Does he not get pleasure from work, from cooking? That would be great if he did. Rabbit cooking. No, he's the reluctant cook. Brand wood. But Brand is still a skill of four. Three. 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 No one can do it but Rabbit. And Rabbit... 
Wait a minute, there is a little mark there. Yeah, there is a mark there. He does get joy from cooking. Okay. But it, apparently not enough. New recruit. We got Pukram. All right. So, where am I? About 50 minutes into this episode. Let's set Pukram. I'll go to my, my list here. Next one in line is Kathra. Got that right? Yeah. So we now have Kathra, who is Melee. So it needs to be set up as... A... Nudist or Worker? What do we do there? Wants to be, but there really isn't that much of a debuff. Doesn't constraining close negative three, so I'm not going to go the nudist route at this point unless something else develops and there's like a, a negative ten on there all the time. Then we'll do that. But otherwise, assign. I want what is our melee? Not soldier. So it was worker, and that grants the. But there was something I didn't do last time, and it just dawned on me. I need to create a new one. Let's do rogues. Edit. Um. Edit. That's what I want right there. Now, nope. let's go back to worker, go to edit. I need the parka to go away. And I need to rename it as worker. Probably doing this wrong. But tell you what, I'll just I'll just do it this way. But worker summer. Alright, worker summer. And close. So all of the workers are now worker summer. So let's do one. Dwayne. Now, let's stop that. Worker, edit, and there's no parka. Okay. So now all the other colonists will dump their parkas. Uh, through this heat wave, I wish I had thought of it, but they've been wearing a parka the whole time. Um, we got rid of Cathra's, but I think Klaus had one the whole time, too. Uh, there's something I missed. Temperature, vent, there there. Okay. So as I try to do with each one, I don't know if there's any that have that I've missed and you want to uh, to hear yours, let me know. But where did Cathra go? First of all, social had a nice chat with Brown. Yep. Gear that's working, though needs a weapon. Let's do this real quick. Shoddy, good. Poor, poor, normal, good. Let's go this route. Plasteel Gladius. But character, Cathra. Childhood, herb world urchin. The herb world's ancient and deep industrial cityscape bursting with humanity and poison. Cathra grew up in the dark, unwanted reaches of such a place she had to fight for every scrap of food. So plus two on shooting and plus four on melee. Torturer. <laughs> so working for a tyrannical monarch and on a medieval world, Cathra earned a reputation as an expert in persuasion. Any prisoner who went down into the dungeon left with no secrets, and with Cathra's smile scarred permanently into their nightmares. Melee plus six. Cannot doctor and cannot warden. Uh, beautiful is exceptionally beautiful, which makes everyone like her. That's helpful. Nudist. Enjoys the feeling of freedom that comes from being nude. Can handle clothing, but would be help happier without it. Cold tolerant, which is preferable if you are a, nu a nudist. So handles temperatures, uh, colder temperatures better than most. So that's the, uh, uh, the background of Cathra. So I think it's time to call this episode done. Um, actually, a lot got done. I'll add some more wall spaces or wall blocks in here and kind of get this finished off and I need to assign Cathra a room so probably going to be in here once it gets finished yeah so I'm going to go ahead and record the next episode and hopefully by then we will have finished all the new construction and probably see the beginnings of a uh, of a new uh, 
uh, raid or something. We'll see. So this has been Noble Rambler. Thank you guys for watching. Hit that subscribe down there if you would. And the, uh, the thumbs up is always appreciated. I'll catch you next time, folks. Bye-bye.